Oh, there's somebody man. there. Ah! <laughs> oh, par- pardon me. Uh, yes, sir. You, uh, Elwood Suggins? Yeah, Elwood P. Suggins. <laughs> P stands for Pershing. And my dad, uh, my dad met General Pershing during the First War just once. <laughs> you are who I think you are, ain't you, uh, Mr. Martin, Mr. Dean Martin? Yeah. Boy, you're just like you are on TV. And What, what are you doing in this outfit, huh? Well, oh, you no. just, uh, it's, uh, I walk around like this. Oh, do you all the time? <laughs> I'll be darned. Just got one suit, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> I raised enough shiny. money to get you another. You could? Sure. Yeah. Listen, what are you doing up here? Well, sit down, sit down. Oh, yeah. Be, just sit down here by the stool. I got my Mackinac. My sister made this. <laughs> she did? Yeah. This, uh, we killed a lamb, and that's what that is. <laughs> what are you going to do up here? <laughs> oh, nothing. I just come over to, just to talk. So I see. Nothing. You want to, did you want to go, uh, do you want to go fishing? That's what I come up here for. What what kind of fish are you after? Bluegill or oh, bass? I don't know, uh, mouth bass? What's biting this year, time of the year? What is Mrs. It? Nestor's biting. <laughs> <laughs> we always get about that. You come up here by yourself? <laughs> I just kidding you. I was yeah. kidding you. Uh, what, what are you smoking? Hmm? Is that one of them regular cigarettes or Hollywood cigarettes? No, that's, that's a regular Ohio cigarette. Is that right? Yeah, regular yeah. kind. My brother-in-law once had, uh, he used to smoke quail, but uh, he straightened up. Um, <laughs> old, uh, old man Nestor is quite a character, you know. I, of course, you don't know him because you've never been up in this, in this neck of the woods, but uh, he goes out back. You talk about her, Mrs. Nestor. Now, he's a character. He's 74 years old, and uh, he goes out there in his underwear. <laughs> out there in the back and hunts night crawlers. You know, it's funny to see an old man like that in, in, his, in his underwear, you know, grabbing worms out the ground. He, and I'll tell you something else about him you wouldn't know about this. But he's got two steel teeth. <laughs> His two front teeth are so- solid steel. I ain't kidding you. And uh, there was an electrical storm here in July. <laughs> and uh, bolt of lightning. Well, I ain't kidding you. Uh, bolt of, so help me. Bolt of lightning come out of the sky. Out from nowhere, man. Struck him on the teeth. <laughs> and he fell forward and plowed three acres of ground. <laughs> Before the Trumby Queens could get to him. The Trumley Twins. One boy's a little strange, the other boy. It's, it, it, it's, only, uh, it's only fair to warn you that uh, there's only one big, great big fish in Mooney's Lake. It's, uh, it's uh, old Sam. He's about five foot long, and he's got a tail uh, at one end of him, and there's an even bigger tail at the other end. <laughs> well, where's his mouth? Well, he don't have one. That's the reason he's so hard to catch. <laughs> We always, you know, you don't have a lot to do up here, but just do what I'm doing, whittling wood, play checkers, and run around the, around the building two or three times to keep them going, going crazy. Anyway, if you plan on doing some serious fishing, what you'll need is, uh, here, I'll put this back in there. That almost went into my leg. <laughs> Hey, are there guys in Hollywood that do that? I mean, I've never been out of this town, so I don't know. We had one guy who was a little weird. <laughs> he was real weird. He well, I don't know. Wore I do, I don't. velvet shoes. 